Hi everyone, you alright? I hope everybody's having a good day. And uh, yeah, yes, we're having a, a we're going for a bit of a walk today. Uh, have a walk down, have a walk around, and see what happens, and see what's happening. Um, yeah. Yeah, have a walk down. Have a walk down and uh, see what happens. So I'll just have a walk down and see what happens and see what's happening. So far, not a lot. Some growth in the wall there. Yeah, which is which is good. Hopefully, it'll grow all the way across the wall. Get rid of get rid of the damn horrible uh, thing. And uh, have a walk in towards town. I uh, just hope everybody's having a good day. Um, yeah. Blackpool has turned around and said that it's going to put a smoking, a smoking ban uh, on the promenade. Because it's uh, sick of cleaning people's cigarette ends. Oh, that will go down with the visitors, I don't know. Um, yeah. Let's go down this, let's go down Sandy Path. We'll just have a walk down. As I say, I just hope everybody's having a good day. And I hope uh, people are being civil to everybody. And... Uh, Things have been pretty quiet in Blackburn so far. Um, there's been a new shop open, German Donner Kebab, GDC. Um, I don't know. Can someone tell me? Is Anum? Anum, the new place to be, or not? Because I just want to know. I want some comments in the comment section below. Because all the uh, pub up there, there's a chat. There's an Indian up there. I know that, and there's quite a few shops up there. Um, but I don't know if they're going to build uh, more retail along there or not. So I'll let the recovery truck go past. And there was a car coming down, I think. I think. Yeah, there's a car coming down. There's several, actually. Good job. It's a good job I stopped, really. Uh, Right, I'm gonna get across now. Come on. See what happens. Well, I just hope everybody's having a great day. And I hope, uh, you know, you're all having a good. We're going past the old East Lancashire Courts Builders site. This used to be the paint shop. They used to have the paint shop down here. They used to, they used to have uh, coaches come down and uh, 
and paint, you know, get them ready for this to scrub them down and get them all ready for paint and everything. And then uh, send them out up to the top there for finishing. And they used to see corks, bus and corks bodies coming out of here like mad, pre painted and everything. All, all the framework was all open. You could see the buses coming out and they were all uh, being painted and everything. Yeah, it was pretty good. Pretty good to watch. But look at it now, it's sat there, sat there, basically doing nothing, you know. If they do come and, if they do put something here, uh, yeah, high rise, <laughs> put, put a few high rise on, on here, and then you can make the most of it. It's full of green bushes and everything at the moment, and yeah, it's okay, it's okay to have this and to have all this greenery here it's uh if they did put if they did put if they did plant more trees on here uh it would be pretty good because uh it would if anything were to happen it would be uh it'd be nice it would be nice for, you know, to suck up the water and everything if it did flood. Yeah, use it as a bit of a floodplain. But uh, we're going past Perry's now, which is, uh, well, it's been here for absolutely donkey's years. Because this wasn't just at one time, this wasn't just a dealership. It used to also be, it used to be a filling station in its past. So where they've built the new showroom at the moment is where the petrol, pump, a lot of the petrol pumps used to be. They dug the, they managed to dig the tanks out and everything, which is a shame, which is a shame. But very soon they're going to have to try and sell as many many of these old these old petrol vehicles, sell them sell them off, knock them down, you know knock you know for knock down cheap price because to be truthful, electric's making electric's making its uh, you know it's making its way and. With an electric vehicle, you don't have to pay. You don't have to pay vehicle tax. And on a diesel or diesel or uh, hybrid, you have to. You have to pay some amount of road tax because it does have an engine. It it does have an engine in it. If it has an engine in it, you've got to pay road tax on it because it goes on the sides of the pe of the petrol and petrol or diesel engine that you have inside it so i'm just having a walk as as yeah as i come out <coughs> and i'm walking further down i can feel the temperature changing um as i go as i go towards town um yeah no some nice good they do have some nice vehicles around here, but uh, you know, like on one of my on one of my videos, it shows it shows a Rolls Royce, a white Rolls Royce, and a Lamborghini, and a Lamborghini, and uh, it's just one of those things that that happens, isn't it? Probably got hired for a wedding. Maybe it got hired to impress somebody. 
you never know. As as we're going now down Lark Hill Lane, it's not too bad today. It's not too bad. I don't think it's too bad today. Um, but uh, it's not as trashy as it usually is when you walk down here. Normally, when you walk down here, there's bottles, bottles, cans, laughing gas cylinders. There's all sorts along here. Back in past videos, I've been trying, trying to convince the council to put litter bins, litter bins and trash bins all the way down here, so that uh, it doesn't give them the excuse. They don't give. It doesn't give them the excuse to throw trash everywhere. Um, and it would basically, you know, give them some incentive to uh, keep the place tidy. You know, but uh, it's just the way it goes, and it? People are people, aren't they? I'm just having, as you can most probably see, I'm having a walk down towards town. One of the major things that black, just like, like in a lot of areas, you have see bottles all over the place. There's bottles and bits of bits of rubbish everywhere so you know if they put if they do put bins along here you know it would save a lot of messing about yeah I'm just having a walk down walk down to town and see what happens um, so if you haven't liked and subscribed, please do so. And uh, yeah, if you look over there, there's a bench. There was, there was a litter bin. There was a litter bin there. And look at it now. They took the litter bin away. They took the litter bin away. And there's crap all over the place over there. You know. So if bins are if bins are provided, you know, in a lot of cases people use them. On Daisyfield, near the bus stop, um, the bus stop near the flats, there's a dustbin there, and people do put their rubbish in there. Yeah, because that's what bins are for. And I see it on Darwin Street. Uh, bins, bins are there to be used. And yeah, it's pretty good when they're used because it stops uh, people like myself tre treading in stuff. I've got a funny feeling that the weather is just ch is is on the ch is on the move, and it's just gone overcast. Hello, oh, that's the twenty. I think that's the twenty-two just gone past. I could have got that, but uh, but I decided not to. I decided to walk it down instead. You know, because I've got to keep moving. You see. Got to keep moving, and uh, yeah, keep moving. Burn up what I've got. What you know, burn some calories or something. Yeah, so no worries. No idea what this is for. No idea. There's, there's been a lot of them popping up all over Blackburn. 
and nobody seems to know what they're for. Um, and, you know, nobody knows. Nobody knows. The ambulance coming up. Still got soldiers in. The army's driving them. The army's driving them. <laughs> So, uh, yeah. So just having a walk towards the town. So, uh, no worries. What pastors gave me to live. So I will just have a walk that walk down into town and we'll just see what happens. And just uh I don't know, the weather seems to have changed quite somewhat and uh, transport is I don't know Do you think Do you think the army should uh, have a go at patient transport? Hello, what have we got? It's re opening It's reopening. Oh, la, la. what have we got here? <laughs> Hi, you all right? You're reopening. You're right there, guys. What did, what are they doing with it? Yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. What are they doing with this building? All oh, right. Right. An art school, eh? Well, might be an art school. So, yeah, it's part of a fair queue outside the DWP office. Without four or five people there. Queuing to get in. And uh, people going in to sign on. You can actually do that at the library, actually. 
to sign on. Electronic sign on. Just having a walk into town. See what's happening. And uh, you know, you never know. I'm uh, having a walk and see what's happening. Not a lot happening really. Um, it's Monday. Tomorrow is Tuesday. I think we might have a nice matter of fact I think I might bring Jennifer up and find out what she's doing tomorrow. Um, so I'm just going to pause the video.